uh, it is possible to present uh, images in Power BI desktop. For this, we need a column that has uh, URLs of uh, those images. Uh, this column should be selected, and in Column Tools uh, Properties Data Category, category uh, we have to designate uh, this column as uh, image column. So we choose option Image URL. Uh, now Power BI Desktop knows that uh, this uh, column has uh, URLs of images. Then we create a new uh, table and we add that column as a field to our uh, table. And this is uh, our final result. Now this will work when we have uh, URLs of our images. But what if we have our images just as um, ordinary files in, in a folder, something like this. In this case we have to uh, raise our own uh, image server. And for this we can use uh, first Python. Uh, we open CMD environment and here first we uh, uh, change current directory. Uh, we change folder to a folder where our uh, images resides. And then we have to uh, start a Python module uh, HTTP uh, dot server and then we type uh, port number. Now uh, this uh, uh, server uh, will uh, present all of our images over uh, this port. And this is uh, what we got when we go to our browser. We go to address uh, which is made of two things. First is IP address of our uh, computer and the other part is port number that we uh, type uh, here. And uh, now we have um, a list of all our images that uh, exist in this uh, folder. Um, uh, a link to uh, any of images will be created as uh, this prefix plus uh, the name of an image. So we got uh, this. And this is a link to our image. So we can uh, create uh, links for all of the images uh, by uh, concatenating uh, these prefix and these names. And that is the list that we can then import inside of Power BI Desktop uh, to be uh, used in a report view. Uh, beside this, if we are uh, watching um, this page uh, only on a uh, our uh, current computer where uh, Python uh, web server is working. Instead of typing um, IP address, we can just use a local host. So this IP address is necessary if we are trying to access uh, to this page from some other computer on our uh, local network. Uh, uh, beside using Python for this uh, purpose, we can also use Mongo server. So we are going to get um, one icon in system train when we start uh, this server and by, by uh, right clicking we are going to get main menu. Uh, here we can uh, change a folder where our uh, images are if we want to and if we uh, click on this uh, option go to local URL uh, this is what we are going to get. We are going to get something similar as in Python so and everything works in in the same way if we add this as a prefix to a name of a column we are going to get a link uh, of uh, an image now uh, mongo server has one more specialty uh, we can uh, turn on this option a global url in this case we are going to get a url that is globally available so anyone in, in the world can access uh, our images and this is usually not something that we want to do and we should uh, turn uh, this option uh, off.